Hello, so the most asked question I get is how do I edit my Instagram stories? So I'll be separating it into two parts because otherwise it'll be too long. So um, today will be the part one where I share with you guys how I edit my videos via Instagram. And part two, which is another video, will be how I edit my uh, Instagram story videos on other apps. So before everything, uh, ensure that your Instagram is on its latest version. Okay, let's go! So I will teach you how to make rainbow gradient text. So like ombre colours. Yeah, so what you can do is you type the text that you want Then uh, you highlight the part that you want to make ombre And uh, now you use one finger to choose the colour you want uh, at the bottom of the spectrum And the other finger holding onto the blue edit point So you can like maybe start from the bottom Yeah, so now slowly drag both fingers together and create your ombre gradient effect so next up, we'll be adding GIF challenges to your uh, Instagram stories. Yeah, so what is a GIF challenge? So I found this cute illustrator's account and I headed to her Instagram highlights under GIF challenge. So what you can do is you hold your screen down and you screenshot your favourite GIF challenge and use it for your Instagram stories to share more about yourself with your audience. So one tip to make your Instagram stories look nicer is to have similar colours on the colour scheme, meaning like complementing colours. So for example, what I can do here is I type my words and um, tap the bottom left tool and select similar colours in my story to use for the words so they complement each other. And um, if you didn't already know, you can actually hold a colour down for a huge variety of colours to use from uh, at the spectrum below. Next one, we will be creating a transparent background. So what I can do is you hold onto the background with the second pen tool and you can create this translucent kind of like filter to it and now you can write text on it or use like this eraser the eraser tool to create shapes like hearts or dots or if you have like a stylus to doodle on the Instagram story it will be much better also so next up we will be doing screen recording so I'm an Apple user so I go to control center, customize controls and drag my screen recording function up. So as long as you have the updated iOS, you can easily swipe up and hold onto the screen recording button to begin. Yeah, and you can easily tap it to end the screen recording. So what the screen recording can help you out with is like you can provide a step-to-step -step guide for your audience or maybe if you wanna like share a video, you know, and it's much easier for them to view and it's also much clearer this way. To make your words stand out, you can type the letters separately and bold the letters. So it creates like a border around each letter and you can also do the same with other fonts and make the title pop out more. So I call this like a new font, you know. So I've seen profiles with really pretty Instagram uh, highlight custom covers. So firstly, you can get this app called Fonto and a background colour that you want to have like the cover on. So maybe you like pink, you can choose pink. Yeah, and um, Google search for an image that suits your category. So for example, like a beauty, you can find a lipstick with a transparent background. Then you save the image and you paste it over in the app and now you can save the photo and you can go to the Instagram stories, upload it and uh, once you are done, you can edit the highlight and crop out the cover that you want. I think Instagram really upped their game with like the GIFs, the fonts and the filters and uh, one of the latest is the pinch to fit on screen function so you don't have to crop out your photos anymore and they can like automatically size it within the Instagram story size. So these are the Instagram story tricks that I use and I thought would be more interesting for you guys. And uh, do let me know if you have other IG tricks to recommend because I love to play around with new methods. And give me a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you would want to see more. I will get the part 2 coming up soon on like uh, the apps that I use to edit my Instagram stories. Bye!